That's what Zayqua in the Woodward Sports Chat says. Is I'd rather trade up for AR. Go get your franchise guy. If you're trade, I, yeah. I agree yep. with you that if you're trading up in this draft, you're getting one of those quarterbacks. Mm-hmm. I agree. And I don't, I don't know that Brad Holm wants to do that. I don't think he does. I, I'd be extremely shocked if that happened. The very transparent Dan Campbell says, yeah, we want to grab a quarterback to develop this year, but the debate that we're having is when. Mm-hmm. And, and again, I told you this yesterday, too. My feeling is that, like, Dan Campbell is on the side of, like, drafting the, the higher-end guy, you know, yeah. the, the guy that's seen as a, a brighter talent. Where Brad Holmes is the guy who wants it, like, later on in the draft. Dan Campbell, point blank, period. Called Jared Goff. A guy who bought you some time. Yeah. A guy that's not going to be here forever. Like, that's, mm-hmm. like, out of your head coach's mouth. And, again, and then, you, know, pre- you know, following that up, too, with the interview with uh, Tim 20 minutes, like, yeah, we, you know, we don't always agree, but, we'll, you know, at the end of it, we, we'll, we'll come to a consensus and we'll, we'll go with whatever that no, decision definitely. is. No, definitely. And I've said multiple times, I, I still – they're going to draft the quarterback this year at some point. A they, thousand percent. They said the they're going to upgrade the quarterback room from what it was last year, and right now they mm-hmm. have the same exact quarterback room they had last year. So they're going to bring in a guy – You've talked about Brad Holmes wants a young guy to develop. We've talked about different guys, you know, a DTR, a Clayton Toon, somebody like that late in the draft. But yeah. would it be that surprising if they got one early? No. It's You have the flexibility to do that. You have the the maneuverability and the the draft capital to be able to do that this year. So I'm not sure exactly. Again, I don't think it's going to happen. I want Jalen Carter at six, flat mm-hmm. out. But – Brad Holmes is is a wizard, man. You never know what he's going to do. He's shown us both that he will trade up to get somebody, or he's shown us that he will trade up to get somebody that he likes. If there's somebody on the board there in the first round that he wants, he has no problem trading up to get that guy.